It's time to grind more, grind, grind. Do 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 do. I am grinding and grinding. Where she got the to grind, grind, grind. Grind, 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 grind. grind. Time to grind to get money for the gods I serve. It's time to grind. Do 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 do. It's time to grind. 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 <coughs> It's time to grind, it's time to grind. It's time to grind, it's time to grind. because tents are so cool and they're so magical. Uh, oh, nobody can summon anymore. Uh... Because tents, I think, cost more than 50 G, don't they? Do 
Let's go. Good. I'm healing. What are we at? <clears throat> uh, 20 something. Cool. I feel like we should just get to 30 in cash and then go sell all our stuff, and that should be enough money to also spend. Okay, well, I'm gonna sell. Oh, so you don't want me to sell stuff yet? I like it as a surprise at the end. Like, alright, all right, we hit 30. What's the bonus? Alright, alright, alright. Okay. And then we'll see how much more grinding we have to do. Yeah. <clears throat> oh my gosh. My throat is stupid. Yeah, we're at 22k. And I'm gonna go wander further out from the town for fun. Okay. into one person, because that's an easier way to travel around. But they're all there, <clears throat> and so the group that you have with you is the group that is with you. Which sounds really stupid, but it makes sense for if there's specific events that require certain people to be at certain places, or optional events for certain people to be at certain places, you have to have them in your party, or else they don't count as actually being there. scary place. Uh, oh, it won't let me in the sand at all? That's boring. smell myself, which is never a good point to be in. So the shower was nice. Cleared up a little bit of the mucus in the cold portion of my face, which is nice. And now I feel a little bit cleaner, and I can no longer smell myself. But I can, but it smells more like uh, body wash, which is nice. So shower was good. You'll have to ask Teddy when he comes out how his shower was. Basically, I like showers. I don't shower probably as much as I should because I forget a lot of days. Or if I don't get out of my pajamas all day, I'm probably just not going to shower because whatever. But I really enjoy the act of showering because it's warm and it's cozy. Um, unless I go for a run and it's hot and I'm hot and then I take really cold showers and then it's cold and it's cozy. Which is almost as good as hot and cozy. <clears throat> So that was my long for answer. Um, and we can ask Teddy when he comes back out.
Hello, friends. Good. Whoa. Whoa. Um, I don't know how to fix what I just did. There we go. Okay, you become the most known person in your country, but you become the most unknown person in the rest of the world. If you talk to someone that's not from your country, they forget you the day after. Would you do it? No. I think that sounds horrifying. I really, 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 really like traveling, and I think I would feel really, really sad if people from other countries, whatever my home country would be of being the most per known person. I think I'd feel really sad if they just sort of forgot me. Um, so no, I wouldn't like that at all. I don't think it would be worth worth being the most popular person in a country, even if it was the biggest country in the world. Um, then it just it doesn't. I don't. Bleh, I don't like it. Nope. Wouldn't do it. <coughs> hungry. Can I, wait, can I make everything whatever I want it to be forever? Like if today I want everything to taste like cheese, tomorrow I can make everything taste like ice cream? Because if so, yes. Because I'm already pretty much constantly hungry all the time anyway. <clears throat> so, might as well. Unless it's like that kind of hungry where everything hurts. Like where you're really, really hungry and you can't stand up because you're so hungry. <clears throat> then maybe not because that's really painful. But, I think if it was just like the normal, like, man, I'm, I'm hungry, then yes, I would totally do that. like take away the specialness of the really nice things because I am imagining that it doesn't have the same texture. Uh, favorite word. I have a word that has a favorite factoid. Uh, the word facetious. It has every single vowel in it in order that it appears in the alphabet and that makes me happy. So I would say my favorite word would be facetious because I love pulling out that fact and then watching people as they spell out the word and realizing that it's true. So there we go, facetious. <clears throat> without experiencing physical pain again, no matter what. Um, because that's actually really dangerous. Because if you can't feel physical pain, you have no idea if you're sick, or if you're hurt, or you have cancer, or you've touched something hot, or anything. So I think that that would be horrifying. Okay. So no, I would never ever ever choose to live without experiencing physical pain again. <clears throat> because I would probably die of touching something that is hot, and not realizing it, because I'm also endlessly clumsy, and hurting myself is the way that I find out that I have fallen over, or have bumped into something. So, no. Yeah, I know, it does exist. It's a very terrible disorder, and for all those reasons I just stated. So, I think feeling physical pain, though it hurts, is super important. I would love 
want to live a life where I'm not clumsy anymore, but I think I would still want the physical pain. That's a really good way to put it. I have a lot of unplanned rendezvous with doors and walls. Rami can attest to this, where he has seen me literally stand still and then run into a wall. And he is not the only person who's seen this. My stepmom has witnessed this amazing feat of agility as well, where it's just I am standing and then I'm in a wall. And I don't really know what the order is that gets me from point A to point B. But it has definitely happened multiple, multiple times. I actually have a chip in this tooth because I once was standing with my stepmom somewhere and I ran into the wall and I chipped my tooth. <clears throat> okay, bye Rami. I don't know where you're going, but bye. Oh my god, I did it. I gotta get even more air in there. Yeah, I think you should. I think we should air out this room. Dave, what is my favorite pastry and why is it a Bosa Bowl? Well, my favorite pastry would be a Bosa Bowl because it makes me want to throw up after eating it, which is a good thing in this case. And I actually wouldn't say it's my favorite pastry, but I'm just gonna roll along with this joke. Um, I think my favorite pastry would really be... Uh, probably a Boston Cream Donut, and I don't even know if that counts as a pastry? Is a Boston Cream Donut pastry? Yes. Okay, then yes, a Boston Cream Donut. Um, because they are delicious. Is it water inside? Oh, yes, I have, I need, yes. I need. I was holding it on my lap. Is it two hours? Yeah. Okay. Um, well, yeah, we can say. It doesn't have to be a surprise at all. It shouldn't be a surprise. Right. But we what have... if what if we get them all hyped up and somebody comes sooner? I don't know who would come sooner. Well, we then they have someone else. That's true. Yeah, so our first scheduled guests are Rich Lamartian and Sarah Amale. Are oh, they coming together? Uh, yeah. Oh my god! Yeah. From what I understand, let me double check before I get everybody all hyped up. Um, okay. um, 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 you know, I, in my head somewhere, I read Sarah Amale, but maybe I made that up. Mm. 
I know I read Sarah somewhere. Yes, Sarah and I are getting this sandwich. Awesome. Yes. Yes, and they're coming at 2.30 with sandwiches. Richard the Martian is a, uh, was a former lead designer at Naughty Dog on the Uncharted series, on all three Uncharted games. Um, and now is a professor at USC and was my mentor when I was in grad school and is probably the only like real sort of mentor I've had in terms of someone who's committing time to me on a regular basis to like mentor me. Uh, and so I value his friendship. Oh my god, we're exactly 30,000. I know. I think I think let's finish up this round. Yeah. And, and then we'll sell go sell things. Um, so he's super smart and wonderful and great. Yeah, he's one of the nicest people I think I've ever met in the games industry and one of the most interesting. Yes. Um, his, his views and his thoughts on a lot of things are really exciting and unique. And he has this way of just being able to come up with ideas. And I really like that and I appreciate that about him. He's also a very nice human being and is the owner of one of my favorite books. Um, which is a book that doesn't have words. It's not a word book. It's a picture book. And it's these, like, crazy lines. And then there's an insert that's clear that has vertical lines on it. And then you pull that page over the pages and it makes beautiful pictures. Wow. And the first time I saw it, I sat there for hours just going through this book and making all the pictures, make pretty, pretty pictures. And it's, it's the greatest thing. And I might drop a link into the chat after I'm done brushing my hair about a video of the book because it's an amazing book. Cool. Um. So that's for the Martian. Sarah, Sarah O'Malley will be with him, who is a good friend uh, who's coming to LA, uh, who is a voice-over artist, voice actor, if you will, but I think the official term is voice-over artist now. Um, she on Indiecade. Uh, she's like essential, or at least she was this year. I don't know her role's been in previous years. Um, and, I don't know, she's been in a bunch of games, she was in Gone Home a bit, uh, she has done lots of indie games that I can't recall at the moment, because I'm a bad friend. Yeah, that happens. That I'm a bad friend? Yeah. Uh, I think this is, like, look at how beautiful this book is, first of all. Oh my god. Okay, here, go, go, yes. Okay, so, like, these pictures are beautiful, and then you put this over it. Oh! Look at that. Have you seen the new, um, logo for Sonos? No. They designed their logo so that when you scroll like through your Twitter feed, it does that. Nice. Because I feel like the pixels. Something about the way they did the gradient and like the pixel stuff makes it look like beats are coming out of it. Ooh. It's so smart. Um, da, 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 da. After Train Jam, what other mode of transportation jam would you like to create? I really want to do like a long form boat jam. Like get on a cruise ship from like Europe to the US or something. Uh -huh. And do like a really long long form isolated boat jam. I think it would be really fun. When? I don't know. Just in the future. That that's the other form of transportation I would like to turn into a jam. Um anyway, that's sort of it. That's all I've got. Uh I had two questions to answer. Oh yeah, uh how was your shower? Phenomenal. Uh, yeah. The more tired I get, the cleaner I need to feel. So, you'll see me at my cleanest, other than like parties and conferences, when I'm really tired. So that's kind of funny, I think. Uh, so I'm super clean. I'm great. Thanks for asking. Uh, I really should have healed first. It's fine. Brrrr. Oh my god. Did Eris just get killed? Yes. That sucks. Oh yeah, so are those the ones with the cards? Yeah. The cards every now and again insta-death. Right, it's like a doom. Or it's not even a doom, it's insta-death. Yeah. Great, whatever. Um, she won't get experience if I don't- well, I can't heal her. Well, you can. You have things down. Oh, but it's, it's too late. The battle's over, yeah. Um, I love the way they animate as they die. Oh, you said the Sonos Twitter does that? The Sonos logo, like, search like Sonos logo Twitter or something. Probably if you go to the Sonos Twitter account, assuming they have one. Yeah, let's do that. I'm assuming so. Can she cast Revive on herself? No. Ah, oh, That would be amazing. Oh, this one? Yes. If you find that in the feed itself, and scroll, you should see it. 
I guess I should use the phoenix down, right? That's yeah, good. you can kind of see it. I mean, it's not like yeah. perfect, but it's, it's... They're just trying to replicate it. That doesn't work. Um, should I use a phoenix down? I guess I should. Yeah, I mean, whatever. They're should not I? super expensive. Yeah, that's fine. I will heal. Yeah, okay, wait. Unreal Ed is asking for the Twitter feed of the one with the gradient. I thought he was talking about Sonos, but I'm not so sure. Yeah, yes. It's just Sonos. I don't know. Okay, you know what? Here. Um, I think you mean this. Oh, the other question was oh, yeah. something. Um, the other question was the last time you played Ninja? Oh, and I was going to say, it's been a couple of years, and I think it's interesting, I've gotten more comfortable with the idea of, like, new games being something I play for a very long time. And, like, so to me, that's something like Towerfall. Right. Although I want to get back into Samurai Gun, because Bo just released the Mac version and a sweet update, so if you guys haven't played Samurai Gun, this is a great weekend to do it when you're not watching a stream if you have friends over, or the next time you're hanging out with friends. Uh, but those are games I feel like I want to play them for a long time. Ninja is like that for some people, not for me, but just on the topic of that. And that's all I have to say about that. Cool. Yeah. Love that scream. Never gets old. We are almost ready to go. I am so excited to rehype the gold saucer. Whoa, we're almost a gold saucer. Woohoo! For the first to, time? We haven't been to the gold saucer before. Ever. Certainly not this day. I would like to, more than we've been, put a mind towards talking about what is special about this game. I think we're talking about it with our emotions. I think so. Oh, our stream looks so professional. It really does! I am so happy that Biggs and Wedge and Jesse are there. Should we swap it out ever? Like, maybe... Maybe. Maybe post kinda, Bold Saucer or something? They're like the official, you know. Yes, I do. Someone's, someone's asking about Mega Man. Um, have you tried the Mega Man Battle Network games? No. What, what are the Mega Man... Tell us about the Mega Man Battle Network games, Ed. Oh, something happened. Who cares? Uh, might be a limit break, which would be worth, uh, something up. I've already set him to two. You have? Yeah. Nope. Okay. Nope. Don't. Don't care. Oh, maybe a material leveled up. Great. Probably. Do, do, do. Remember that time that Teddy and I was doing Sonic Cannon all weekend? And then it also ended up being Sonic Cannon's birthday? Yeah. You should tweet the witch and Sarah are coming so that people oh, yeah. can tune in. Because if it's a surprise, then people miss it. That's true. Um, I need, I need a square mole that TV. What? What? Too big. And. I'll change it to a I still need a solution for tomorrow. I for do want to watch the Super Bowl. Well, we can, like. Can we set up another. Computer streaming the Super Bowl, or is that not? Is I that don't not know if happens? we can, but I, yeah, I don't know if it's available to stream. I think it might be. It's or picture in picture, is that a thing on your TV? No, and I don't have cable. Oh, so. okay, yeah, I don't know how to do this. <sighs> okay. Uh, if you want to level up, if you want to one up Nika or Rich is bringing us sandwiches, buy us cable. Except the cable guy would have to come. Oh, no, wait. Yes, forget it. Don't do that. I don't want cable ever. Guys, it's almost time. I need to go back in the bathroom for 30 seconds because I missed the spot shaving. It's driving me crazy. I'm gonna kill everyone. Oops, forgot to heal again.
Fred. So the first official Final Fantasy VII weekend special guest will be Sarah Wallet and Rich Lamb delivering sandwiches at 2.30 p.m. PSG. Yes. You should include an image, one of his images, every one of uh, oh, yeah. Planck's images let every me, time you tweet. Yeah, let me download all these images. Yeah, that will make that. everything yeah, <coughs> Good luck downloading them. No one knows how. <laughs> yeah, it's a mystery. Uh, we're done. We did it. Yeah, I mean we're out of magic, so. Yes. We're at Thirty-five. So let's go sell stuff. Hi. Oh wait, I should. Well, I'll save after. Yeah. Actually, just in case yeah, we sell we something. Yeah, just something though. up. Whenever you want in to sell and buy stuff, it sounds to save. As a chronic oversaver. Um, ah, Unreal Ed's favorite underrated game is the Mega Man Battle Network series. They're alike, but not really enough, in my opinion. It is by far, in my opinion, the best combat system in any RPG ever. It's got the perfect amount of customization, planning, and real-time action. In whose opinion? In his opinion. They're basically Tron meets Mega Man meets Magic meets an action RPG. What? On the internet. Wow. For what platform? He asked. Uh, store? Do you know where the store is here? Uh, is this? Uh, yes. Or is that the train depot? No, train depot. No, that's not thing. What is that? No, I think the store is down, and I think the one on the left. Nope, nope, left, left. Yeah, that guy. Nope. What? Like, oh, this like, dude yeah, just standing here? Oh no, that's the weapons. Well, you can sell stuff here. buy anything. Yeah, sell items. Okay, um, first make sure everybody has the right thing equipped. Quest. Okay, let me download these things. If you're just See, joining I us... I save as. I can save this picture. Is that... or is that... is that an HTML? Oh no, it's an HTML. Okay. Right. If you're just joining us, we've been power grinding to get money for Cosmo Canyon because this is not, not a Cosmo games Canyon. done fast. This is a games done thoroughly and indulgently. But it's not for it's not for Cosmo Canyon. It Sorry, is for the gold, gold saucer. saucer. I get those confused. We also haven't Eight. slept. Uh, protects against frog. Lol. Lol, lol, lol. Ooh. What? We had a double and we weren't using it. What? But she loses cure all. Does she have it? Oh, she has another. Okay, connection. yeah, we can put cure all in that. Damn. Damn, son. Oops. Oh, I'm gonna fix the web page. Uh, sure. And then will you show me how to edit it? Because I do want to tweak it later. Yeah, I can. Uh... Have we unlocked any of the unlocks? We should also have like a where are we? You should just grab a quick walk through table of contents. Yeah. And do a thing where we can be like, That's here's true. where we are. And people would really appreciate knowing that without having to interpret. Alright, so let's look at materia, shall we? Okay, um, prison, elemental, I crit, crit, yes, all long range, range. yes, all long range? fire all. Long range is really, is really great because it okay. makes him way protected. Okay, um, yep. Uh, steel. I don't ever use steel. Do you use steel? No, I just had it in here because. Okay. Like, Should we? I'd almost rather use sense or something. If we're gonna do battle arena or something, it might be useful. Maybe. I mean, eh, it's whatever. sense or enemy skill, and we're not gonna. We're never actually gonna use steel, so I'd rather yeah. use sense. Fire, Shiva, Chocobo lure. We're just leveling up. Yep. Which, nice. in which case, we could give it to somebody else if, if uh, uh, ice all. Sure. Yeah. Okay. That's good. Oh. Wrong button. Ugh. Buttons. Okay. Restore. Yes. Oh wait, we have to fix that. Yeah. Fix yeah. That. Yeah. yeah. Fix so, it. Heal, revive, heal, restore. What the go what the crap is heal? Heal is poison, and it's unit. Oh wow. Okay. Lightning. Yeah, she's all locked up. I think we're good here. So let's see what we can sell. All right. So make sure not to sell weapons of people that we don't have yet, though. Good point. Just in case. Uh, we found out this doesn't get us anything. It's a loco weed. Nothing. Yeah, those things don't get us anything when we sell them, huh? Yeah. Can I sell the battery? 
Okay, we can sell the mithril armlet. Oh, he uses these guards. Guard stick? Um, I don't know who that's It's Eris, right? Is it? Oh, yeah, that, that's 70 gil. That's nothing. Go scared for. of it? Yeah. Alright, what were um, you gonna say? Mithril armlet? You can sell the Western Sword. Great. Mithril armlet? Yeah, because yeah. we have four of them. Yeah. And we don't need four of anything. Yep. Go for it. Um. I want to breed Chocobos, nice. Mine source, we need Star Pendant. We don't need, th well, if we come across some super deadly yeah. poison, then we need it. That Tufi. Oh, this is super weird. I don't understand what they are. Keep it. Lux source, speed. We need to use these. Power source, holy crap. Yeah, we should use these at some point. Although we don't quite know our direction yet for levels, you know, in the final party, so yeah, those so are great to see. Good. Okay, do we not actually have a lot of stuff to. We maybe don't have any. Full metal to staff we can sell because we just unequipped that from Aris. Okay, yeah. cool. That's an easy, 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 even 36k. Damn. 36, should we do a little more? I feel like 6k is not a lot because we went in, we had like. Well, I we we went around. in with 100k, with 100 gil uh, last time. I still feel like I want to do one. So more the games round. tend to be about 200 gil. Yeah. Do we want to sell like a sense or something? Yeah, we don't need two senses, do we? <gasps> Shit! Shit's on. How much was that just then? Well, we were at an even 36, so 428. Whatever. I, I mean, we don't ever need two senses, so we're fine. One of them's equipped. Yeah. Um, okay, let's not do that again. Okay. Um, wait, scroll down. Wait, scroll down. Okay, yeah, wait, wait, no. Eh, eh. What do you want? Material? Wow! No, go back up. Look at how much that's worth if it's mastered. 84,000 gil. Price for master. Whoa, interesting. Ooh. Oh, so you can farm materia. Yeah. Okay. Oh, I... you can flip materia in this game? Yeah. I wonder if that's a good strat. Probably not. Probably not. Well, if you have like a quadruple <laughs> thing and you're doing really powerful enemies? True. Maybe. I don't know how much AP inflates over time. Anyway, I think 6,000, a little over 6,000 gil is enough to play a bunch of games. Are you sure? Because we've gone this far. Well, save right outside the town just in case it's not. Okay. But I think it should be. And the nice thing now is that yeah. if it's not, we, we can leave the gold saucer. Yeah. No, we don't uh, have to reboot the game. Uh, the whole point of getting a lifetime pass uh, right. is okay. so that we don't have to leave the game. Guys, guess where we're going. Oh, yeah, I totally forgot about this. What? When you master materia, it creates a new one. <gasps> I forgot about that. Oh, my God. I totally How forgot about the mechanic. Let's just do that. Uh, no. Power level! Okay, uh, wait, I was gonna go to the gold saucer, but I'll wait for you. Okay, go for it. Okay, we're waiting five seconds for Teddy to finish shaving his face. and then completely ah. forgot to drink it. Well, okay, are we going? Mm. Gold saucer hype! Gold saucer hype! Gold Where saucer are we going? hype Where is down gold? left. Yeah. Gold saucer, gold saucer, we've never been there before. Oh my gosh, what is this? Oh my gosh, what is this place? A cutscene? What was this about Deirdre or something? About what? Some character? You were talking at the time. Oh, uh, Barrett has a flashback here about how he got kicked out this? of the town. Yeah. So Barrett's gonna tell us this really sad story about how he got kicked out of this town because I think he inadvertently murdered the town in a way. Like not murdered them. Oh right, the um, mining town where the guy punched him in the tummy. Yeah. It's rough. But I forget. Actually, let's watch this cutscene for real again so that we know what happened to him. Cause I forget. I completely forget. I know this is kind of the end of Barrett's arc. Uh, my hometown. It was a coal mining town. Great. Okay. Dusty and poor. It's a real small. What does that sound? Um, 
first time you ever heard of Mako. Oh, bye Unreal, Ed. See you later. It's coming back after dinner. Bon appetit. What are we gonna do? Uh, the only one I'm close is Dine. I am definitely against it, no matter what. Okay, so this guy is opposing the reactors. Barrett is assuring everyone that a Mako reactor will be great. Okay. That emote was too long. Pro tip from Ben Esposito yesterday. Yeah? Adding head tracking to characters makes them feel much more alive. Just like if they're always looking kind of where their goal is, instead of just straight ahead. Huge. I really want to get our speakers working. Like, maybe before we get a gold saucer we run this experiment, before we get into prime time. You want to try and fix I the speakers? I would like real sound, yeah. How do you feel about that? We could do that. I don't think we can stop it now. Oh wait, yes we can. We can just not press A right now. Okay, okay uh, chat. Um, we're gonna mess around with the sound a little bit because we have speakers that we'd really like to actually have work. I'm going off laptop speakers. Yeah. The biggest problem that we're gonna have though is it's gonna come through the microphone. I don't want it louder, I just want the quality better. Okay, yeah. Like, I want a little bit more bass. The mic's not gonna pick that up anyway. Um... Um, it'll just be a minute. Yeah, so it's gonna be a minute of us sort of messing around with the timers. But we'll be, or not the timers. Uh, I might stop the stream. Um, I said timers because Elfspit asked you a question about timers. Oh, yeah? Um, Teddy, okay. do you use alarms in Game Maker or custom code your own timers? Uh, we're all 100% custom code. 100% custom the only code. code actions, or the only actions we use, we use the events obviously, and then the only actions we use are code events.